Introducing Firefox OS, an open source operating system designed for phones and tablets. Firefox OS, like Android, is based off of Linux. Mozilla's goal was to make an operating system that was completely open and can run on low-end devices. This should remind you of Android in every way, shape, and form. They share similar lock screens, settings menus, and even pull down notifications. So how is this different from Android? Firefox OS is built entirely using HTML5 and other open web standards. HTML5 is the same markup language used to build websites and is completely open to developers. For the user, this means that there are already lots of popular apps available to download. Alright, so let's take a walk through a Firefox OS. To unlock the device, you slide to the right. Similar to Android, you can change your wallpaper simply by holding down anywhere in an empty space. Once again, similar to Android. Sliding to the right gives you your app drawer. Tapping and holding on the icons allows you to change which app goes into your bottom quick launch drawer. The settings menu is pretty much a reincarnation of Android settings just with a few added features. However, this could be cleaned up a bit because I found myself constantly fumbling back and forth trying to look for the appropriate submenu. Oh, and have I mentioned that there's no virtual navigation? Everything is done through gestures. Swiping from the bottom will always bring you to your home screen. I think it's actually pretty neat and something that I would like to use in Android. Needless to say, Firefox OS comes with the Firefox browser by default. The browser still needs a little work though. Web pages are awkwardly scaled and I'm not sure if it's just because I'm using a 1080p device or the browser itself. Also, there's a lot of noticeable lag when flicking through the page. Now that brings us to the marketplace. I was actually surprised to find that there's already a growing selection of apps. Now granted, HTML5 does have its limits, so some apps only work online, and some games just look plain horrible. However, Firefox OS isn't meant for the power user. Firefox is designed to work with low end hardware and devices. So Firefox OS, would I recommend it above Android? No. Would I recommend it above Ubuntu Touch? Maybe. Mozilla has a challenge. They have to work to compete in a mobile market that's predominantly saturated with Android and iOS devices. Until they can successfully prove that they have a strong ecosystem ready for users, my decision remains unchanged. So for now, Firefox OS is another small operating system that remains niche oriented. Alright guys, so thanks for watching. If you want to try Firefox OS on your Nexus 7, I'll find a link in the download description where you can download and flash it like any other normal ROM. And if you liked this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And as always, thanks for watching and stay tuned for some more Galaxy videos. Thanks.